All right, here we are with Heather. Hey. So, um, how's your week been? It's been cold. It was really cold. <laughs> that was, yeah. Um, that was like the worst of it. Oh, it was, it was a tough week, but it was over. Were you, New week. how'd you fare with the rain last night? Oh my God, it was terrible. Yeah? Oh, it was so bad. Were you, yeah. were you under a roof? Um, no, I was under the overpass. Oh, okay. So that wind whipping through must, must have oh been something. Oh my god, that was so bad. It was like piercing. Yeah. It doesn't matter how much you have on you, it's like, ah. <clears throat> yeah, we got a ton of blankets, right? No, I did not know that. Okay, so make sure you take a ton of blankets. Okay. Um, so you're, you're planning on getting drying up? Yeah, I think I want to. I'm pretty sure. And I never said that. Okay. Ever. When? After Thanksgiving. I don't know why I keep saying after Thanksgiving. I don't know why I want to do that. I, I want to get a hotel room for Thanksgiving and cook. Like one of the rooms you can cook in. Mm -hmm. So we'll see if it happens. If it don't happen, then the hell with it. And I'll... So why Thanksgiving? Why I not? don't know. Why I just want to cook. That's why I don't want to go there. <laughs> why not dry up right now? I don't know. I guess... I don't know. I can't answer that. It's like, I, I like planning shit. Mm -hmm. Well, how about you plan for tomorrow? Tomorrow. <laughs> tomorrow is the day to dry up. Yeah. You know what true. I mean? Because if you kick it, kick it until Thanksgiving, you'll kick it until Christmas, and you'll kick it until New Year's. No, I know I won't. I never said I wanted to do this before. I tell you straight up, I'm not going nowhere. I don't want to rehab. You've heard the saying. you want me to. No time like the present, right? Yeah, that's true. That's absolutely true. Um, I mean, whatever. Okay. How much were you spending on your habit? <sighs> I you when I had good money I used to spend like four hundred a day but some it's not that great out somewhere. <laughs> no. So no. How much did you spend so far today? Today oh I haven't had nothing yet. Oh, what's Six it? hours. Two o'clock. Yeah about that. Take? I don't know. <clears throat> My phone was stolen. So when was the last time you used? Mm, like six hours ago, seven hours ago. About that. So you're getting edgy then? Yeah, I'm really, I'm yucky. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry to hear that. Yeah. But you know what? You're six hours into sobriety. Mm-hmm. Right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> you look at the silver lining, you know? You're already started. Look at that. Yeah. Fantastic. Congratulations. I guess. <laughs> <clears throat> you're, you're dreading this, dude. I don't want to be sick. Like, I know I can do it without having to be like dog sick. Like I can. Yeah, but well, you know you're going to be dog sick. Uh, not if I do it the right way. What's the right avoid way? That. You might not feel top notch, but you're not going to feel like bleh. So you what is I mean? the right way? Like I plan on doing a shot and walking in the building. Oh, did, okay. Mm -hmm. And just let them do it, like medically detox me properly so that mm. so you we don't need, really have to get too close to the edge. What do you need to start that? Uh, probably like 20 bucks. 20 bucks. Yeah. I don't want to get zooted. I just want to be okay for a little bit while I have to go through no, no, the process. I mean, what do you need to get through the process of detox? Um, probably subs, support, sleeping agents, <laughs> food. I mean, before you go in, are they going to require anything from you? That I don't know. Because that if you're planning I've on never done it. Okay. So I don't know. So I mean, I know some places I've heard like they want. Like you have to have like uh, unopened stuff, like hygiene stuff and some clothes and... Well, I mean, we can hook you up with all that stuff. Right. Unopened hygiene stuff and, right. and clothes and stuff like that. Right. What we can't help you with right this second is like ID, if they require right. ID. So if you need an ID... I have a picture of my ID. I know, but are they going to accept that? That That's, I don't know yet. So you have to find out because if you need the physical ID, right. now's the time to start planning for that. We right. can help you with that. We have a PO box you can use. Really? I think we mentioned it last time that uh, if you if you need to collect mail, you know, you can have it mailed to our PO and bring it up for you. Really? Yeah. So, I mean... It's our little way of trying to help out. Yeah, that's yeah. definitely clutch. Yeah. So we will give you the uh, a PO box information. Okay. Uh, we'll write it down for you. And uh, you know, if you have, if the state needs to mail you forms that you have to fill out or something mm. along those lines, um, we can you can have them mail to the PO. We'll bring them up next next Monday when we come up, and you can okay. uh, fill them out, throw a stamp on it. And we'll 
put it back in our PO box to get collected, you know? Okay. So that's awesome. Thank you. Yeah, you're very, we're out here trying to help as absolutely yeah, as much as possible. You guys are awesome. You guys you know? are definitely awesome. Um, <clears throat> so how are you going to find out what you need? Um, I need a phone or a use of a phone, yeah. but I could probably make that happen. Honestly. Yeah. Yeah. You borrow a phone and just probably call in. Probably. Are you thinking a couple bucks or something? Nobody does nothing for free out here. Unfortunately, right? You can't even rent a floor for free overnight, right? No. Um. Yeah. So, do you plan on staying in the area when, while you're getting clean, or are you planning on going long distance? Um. I don't want to be near Camden, but I don't know about long. I don't know about too far. Well, you want to go far enough away where you don't know your stomping grounds, right? Um, this is my only stopping ground. I only run here. Right, so... I don't you, like anywhere else. <laughs> so maybe somewhere south or, you know, an hour south, an hour north, something that... Yeah, that, I would, so yeah, not, that's what I mean. Like, I would do that, definitely. So it's not so convenient. You know, yeah, I would do that in a heartbeat. I don't want to be close to here at all. <clears throat> so, um... Yeah, so we'll write down the P.O. Box information, our email address, and if you want to email us, hey, I need this form, that form, we can burn it off, you know, we can print it off and, and bring it up for you to fill out and stuff like that as well. Okay. I mean, we have a printer at home, so we can right. print out state forms and stuff like that, and, okay. and you can fill it out and autograph it and all that, you know. We can't be your secretary, but we can definitely right. help you mail stuff back cool. and forth and, and get the... I'd like for you to um, at least start getting ID. Yeah. Because that's probably something they're going to ask for. Right. Um, so if you can like jot down some, I mean, we're, you were born in Jersey? Yeah, I'm born in Jersey. Okay. Me too. West Jersey. Uh -huh. Yeah. Okay. Um, so we could probably fill out, you know, print off a New Jersey DMV ID registration or something like that that you could. I might be able to get the, um, uh, do the replacement thing online. Okay. Um, they did one place your ID for eleven dollars or whatever, okay. and then they you print something out and then they mail you something in seven to fourteen. They mail you the actual in seven to fourteen days. And I only know this because my friend had to do it. Okay. His wallet was taken, and he did everything online, and they mailed it to his mom's house. Well, that would be super cool. You could have it right almost you know, right. within two weeks. Right. All right. So we'll look. We'll look into that, and you know, if you want to give us a, a you know, we'll snap a picture of your ID and see if we can start working that paperwork through for you okay and that might help out a little bit huh? yeah but i know they're, they're probably going to ask for id yeah when you go to okay go into the center so we'll start from there um one last question what's on your christmas list um let me see. I, I don't know i don't want to be here <laughs> well if you hold to your promise i don't want to be here I'll of tell thanks, you after thanksgiving so if you hold to your promise you won't be here yeah right? that would be awesome i don't want to be here so, how about something material? Um, <laughs> no? I don't know. Okay. Well, you can think I've about it. I've never been material. I don't know. Well, I mean, something that, you, something that you think you need out here for the next two weeks that you're going to be out here. Because you're going clean from then, so. A phone. <laughs> or, you know, you want a crossword puzzle book for when you're... I know. Uh, word search. I like word search. <laughs> okay. Um, yeah. Yeah, something like that. Adult coloring book? No, I can't do that because hmm. my wrist. I can't hold the pencil long enough. But um, I love makeup. Yeah. I love makeup. So we want like a mannequin head and some makeup. <laughs> yeah, that'll be cool. <laughs> All right. Well, thanks for the conversation. Thank you.